In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at our results when we truncate our term uh, in the Academic Search Complete periodical database. Now in this database, um, we have different fields that we can type into. I'm going to go ahead and limit my uh, results to titles only, just so it's easier to demonstrate where our search terms are showing up. But uh, when you're doing your search, you probably don't want to do that. But for, for right now, I'm going to go ahead and limit my results to only the title. And let's just start out by doing a search for the single word fracking and click on search. So this is a basic search and when I look at my results I'll see that each one has the word fracking somewhere in the title. Okay, so it did exactly what I asked it to. But now let's go back after receiving 291 results that have the word fracking in the title, I'm going to go ahead and truncate my term to see if I can get more results because there might be articles out there on fracturing or fracks or different word variations of this uh, particular word. So I'm going to cut off my ing and use frac as my root and then insert the truncation symbol in this database which is the asterisk and so before I had 291 results for the word fracking in the title let's go ahead and click on search now and now I have a lot more now I have 351 results now that also might throw in some odd results so my first one is called what the frack is in our food which really doesn't have anything to do well maybe it does have something to do with fracking yes it does in fact here it is hydraulic fracturing um, but the second one is frack to the future and so I'm saying that it did in fact truncate my terms and it found the different word variations for me now I want to caution you from truncating your word to too small of a root so let's go ahead and take off the K and truncate it further. So now I'm having the situation where I have one of those really short root words that, I, that we talked about in the tutorials. Now if I click on search instead of 351, look here, now I have almost 60,000 results. Now why is that? Because there are a lot of words that start with F-R-A-C, including uh, just plain old frac, fractural, fractions, just think of all the words that start with that root. Here's just fracture. Okay, there's a lot. F fracture, fractured. So now I'm getting into the situation where I have a lot of results that have really nothing to do with fracking. So that's why we don't want you to use very short roots. Really put some thought into it and make sure that you're just cutting it down to the basic root and not any further. So probably F-R-A-C-K with the asterisk would probably be the best way to truncate that particular word.